Breaking news first at noon. Five police officers are killed in the line of duty in Dallas during a street protest against police violence. And now we're learning more about one of the suspects and a possible motive. Before this morning's opening bell, the New York Stock Exchange held a moment of silence to honor the fallen officers in Dallas. The officers ambushed is the story we've been following since last night. And this just in, sources tell the Associated Press that police have identified the gunman as 25-year-old Micah Johnson. The chief said this morning during the standoff, he said he wanted to kill white people, especially white officers. CBS 4's Don Champion has the latest developments from Dallas. At least one gunman ambushed police officers just after a peaceful protest was ending in downtown Dallas. The attack sent the crowd running for their lives. I was screaming, run, 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 active shooter, active shooter. Twelve officers were hit. Fellow officers rushed to their sides. Five of the officers died. We're hurting. Our profession is hurting. Two civilians were also injured. Police cornered the suspect identified as Micah Johnson and negotiated with him for hours. Johnson told police he was acting alone. He was upset about Black Lives Matter. The suspect stated he wanted to kill white people, especially white officers. Negotiations broke down with Johnson and police got into a gunfight. Officers then used a bomb attached to a robot to kill him. Police have three other people in custody. Much of the downtown area is a crime scene. A 10 block area will remain closed today as police investigate. In Poland overnight, President Obama called the shootings despicable. There's no possible justification for these kinds of attacks or any violence against law enforcement. The protest was one of several held across the country last night in the wake of two officer-involved shootings of black men in Louisiana and Minnesota. Videos of both shootings went viral. The police ambush in Dallas is the deadliest day in law enforcement history since the 9-11 attacks. This must stop. This divisiveness between our police and our citizens. The city's police chief is asking for the nation's support. Don Champion, CBS News, Dallas.